the theater nerd in me is losing her mind and then I'm just trying to play it cool like this was always the plan but no. <laughs> I'd maybe entertain the idea of off-Broadway so to have leapt straight to Broadway is I'm still uh, catching up with that. Amy has such an incredibly light touch with her language. She's incre she's really really efficient. She's able to construct a sentence or a grouping of words that will make you laugh and for some reason cuts really deep really quickly. I play two characters. I play Sherry, the home nurse uh, for Mary Jane's son Alex and I also in the second act play Dr. Toros, Alex's pediatric intensivist. I'm playing Amelia, who is a college student in town visiting her, Aunt Sherry, who is Mary Jane's night nurse. I play Brianne and Chaya, and Brianne and Chaya are two moms in Mary Jane's life. One of them is learning, she's very much steep learning curve, and the other has a little more wisdom a little more life experience. I forget that it's all women, to be honest with you. I do. I'm, I've been so reminded of that. But um, it doesn't feel like it's until you're having lunch or something, yes. you know? And then, you know, you're just sort of relaxing. We had a pediatric doctor come talk to us. I've had the actual equipment that I'm gonna use, medical equipment. Those things are a tremendous help. Like April was saying, we have a number of people coming to share their expertise. I believe tomorrow we have a rabbi coming to speak with us. Yes. When I first talked to Amy and Annie, I said, you know, I, I've never done this before and you still wanna carry on with this conversation? Okay, fine. Amy and I got to visit her um, in Georgia and I felt like that trip really made me think about Rachel as a mother and a sister and a friend who happens to act. Even if you've never had an experience like anyone has in this play, and there's a lot of different experiences in the play, even then you feel seen somehow.